Hey, what's happening, gamers? Welcome back to Fire Emblem Three Houses on K-Wing's Let's Plays. Yay! Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and hit that bell to be notified when more Fire Emblem arrives every day at 3 p.m. Woohoo! So today we are going to do a red battle because reasons. Okay, so we're not doing a paralogue today. We're going to do battle in the kingdom. Whoa. Red battle. How bold of you, Luke. And uh, let's see. Our, uh oh. I'm just curious about how things are going on. So we've got uh, some. Oh my gosh. Some stuff happening. Oh, she's ready for support. Dorothea. Good. Good, 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 good. All right, let's rumble. Battle in the Kingdom, White Clouds, Chapter 8, Flame in the Darkness. Hey, so. Okay, so let's see uh, who our units are that Amber has been messing with. Yeah, you can put whoever you want on the battlefield. Okay, so, so we've got... Oh, yeah, that's right. Oh, uh, well, actually, they changed it up anyway. Uh, I, I actually wasn't playing with Ash for a while, because he oh, was ooh, kind of OP. Okay, all right. You got rid of our healer? What? I have Flane. I don't need Mercedes. Plus, Mercedes is making almost A rank with everyone. It's like getting me nervous. Oh my gosh. She's going to be a nun anyway, so she doesn't. Okay, can I say my three top guys for marriage for Ambi Chan? Okay, real quick. All right, so Dadu mm -hmm. is number one. Mm -hmm. Then after that is Dimitri. And if Dimitri goes insane, then it's going to be Sylvain. Okay. All right, that's, those are good choices. Well, let's go. Route the enemy. All your units fall in battle. <laughs> yeah, I don't think that's going to happen. So let's do this quick. Uh, who do you have? Ambichan is now an archer or... Oh, a spear person. Cool. I mean, she has several weapons, but I've been trying to level her spear knowledge up. May as well. Because the more different weapons she com becomes knowledgeable at, the more she can recruit people. That's true. So Should that's what I was doing there. Ooh, she's almost... No, she's not quite at a B rank yet, but she's getting there. And longbow. No, oh, iron I mean, bow. Well, no, that's just because he was... You can just get... Well, no, he just... The last person he fought was a long... Uh, a long range oh, person. Oh, okay. Why is... Why is... So I, why is our Gundam glowing green? What What's up with to do? I what would... What should I do? I don't know, but I, I wouldn't use the longbow with Dimitri. I would just have okay. him use a regular javelin or whatever. That's my cue. That's yeah. my cue. She can just... attack from there. Whoa. Yeah. Oh yeah, you're still gonna level oh. Dorothea up by having her near Amy Chan so she well, gets to how... level B. Oh, since they're okay, so if you guys are grinding characters, um once they reach their C rank conversation, they don't get hearts anymore until after you fulfill that thing. Yeah. So Basically, Dorothea didn't really need to be in the party this time around. I because, guess we'll have to have that conversation, yeah. and then... Gonna have to have that conversation. Yeah, I mean, I would put Dimitri right next to Ambichon, and then... Alright, I'll just watch you. I, I would take the bow away from Dimitri, though. Okay. He, he just randomly has a bow What's for no next? reason. I don't even know why he has that bow. Whoa! Got it. Good nice go. going, Sylvain. Oh, and he's already ready for a C-rank conversation with her then, because she didn't. Nothing happened. Okay. Well, he's my backup guy uh, okay. for marriage. Oh, so he I have I have had Ambichan in battle next to Dudu, Dimitri, and Sylvain. I have three guys I'm kind of dating just in case. Holy cow! I am spent. <laughs> She's an A-rank now. Okay. I'll go. All right. Yeah, Luke, things are, you know, changing. Not that I mind. I mean, Why this is I cool. Here? Good job, guys. Ah, okay, so you didn't do much with them. All right. All right. No, because Ready. Felix is supposed to be with... I want him with a net. Ah, that's right. I forgot. Okay, so we got some XP a little bit there. I know you'll make my job harder and level people up with all kinds of new, like, pairings and <laughs> make me, like, crazy <laughs> thinking about <laughs> it. <laughs> There's nobody for... We have to level blue-haired girl up with Ash whenever we can. I just... I really hope we can get blue-haired girl. I feel like we shouldn't have brought Bernadette in. Now, I mean, I'm the one who told you to bring her in, but now I'm having second thoughts. Like, I like Bernie. She's fun. Oh, wait, not Bernadette. I meant uh, the other person, Dorothea. I like Bernadette. Bernie's fun. Well, I don't think Bernie has an A rank with Felix anyway. No, she doesn't have an so A rank. So that's why Annette 
uh, is going to have A rank with Felix, which I think... No, nope, Bernie is has an A rank with Felix. I know, but you, you have your heart set on a net, so... That's why I have to, like, push so much behind the scenes. It's not so much, like, to level up the characters, it's to force the couples I want to be together. If they don't have S ranks, they don't necessarily... I don't think anyone has an S rank except for Amy Chow yeah. and her person. This is just in your little... Um... In my mind, when they have an A rank, they're married. Okay. I mean, except for if two people have an A rank that I didn't want to have an A rank, and then they're not married. <laughs> oh! We have a burp. Wait, what? <sighs> King of Wings. Why is the bird attacking bad That's, guys? That sounds like some kind of, like, like name of a restaurant. Is it Bird of Wings? Uh, King of Wings. Oh, uh, yeah. That's weird. Mm. Okay, well, no big. Aww. Uh, thought I could attack from there. Sylvain! You can't attack either, but you can at least, you know, do that. What about you? No, still can't reach. Ooh, iron gauntlets, nice. I like that. Okay. Help, uh, Dimitri out a little bit, even though he doesn't need it. And I have to say, it's- I feel like there is a love triangle going on between- Oh, good job, Dorothea. I feel like the love- the actual love triangle going mm. on is between Dimitri, Sylvain, and Dim and, um, Ingrid. Really? Yeah. I feel like she could marry either of those. Oh, you gave Ash a shield! Nice! Oh yeah, I did. That That's was right. Tough. It's helpful. Good job. Thank you. Okay, so... Uh, I guess... Ingrid is kind of... Pretty cool. I just try to do what I can behind the scenes, because mm -hmm. I know that you can only like, play through the levels, and you don't have a lot of time to, like, mess around with things, so I just try to get shields, and... I did buy a lot of, like, well, not a lot, but a few concoctions and vulnerables just for the future. Mm-hmm. For the future. <sighs> Ooh. No, I don't think so. Cool. Good job. All right, now to do... No, you can stay there, that's fine. To do... You, actually, you know what? I want to see what Flane can do. Flane was not very strong last time. I saw her, so... I just took Mercedes out completely and just have been using Flane as my healer, like, the entire time. Does she have Physic now, or...? No, not yet, no. but I'm trying to work towards it, because I... I don't like depending on just one healer. Mm. I always want a backup, plus... Like I said, I don't want Mercedes to marry every man on the whole field, because... Uh, number one, she's a nun. <laughs> number two, <laughs> number two, she needs to back off all my options. So, oh, she's she's getting hearts with everyone that she basically is healing, which is everyone. So, doesn't feel like she's very nun-like. It feels like she's kind of like a player or something. So, oh, saying. yeah, that's interesting. Yeah, interesting would be the. All right, next enemy phase. I think I tried to give Felix a shield, but I don't know if it's really working. It doesn't appear on him. I don't know if he has the shield or not. I don't even want to know how much money you've made. I'm scared. Well, I mean, I don't know if it's possible, but if we can recruit people using gifts, if we can buy gifts for people, like... I don't know if you can buy gifts, though. So. I, I, I think you they're from to, exploring. I think you have to pay gold every time you send someone, like, flowers or a gift. Uh, at this point, $200 is just a drop in the bucket. I mean, if you're... Even if you have, like, 50,000 gold, 200, you know, technically maybe $400 a month for birthdays is nothing when you're going to so make that up easily. So would they be recruited more with tea or with gifts? I... I heard it's gifts, but what? also, if you... One person I know, they they grinded so much that Ambichan's bow and spear and um, sword abilities were all B, and they were really easy to get the people they needed. That's what I've been trying to do. That's why I'm trying to grind... Like, she's a spear. I'm trying to use her spear now so I can level her spear up. Also... Oh, never mind. I was going to say those statues that we can get more experience on... 
You can't really. You have to get renown to you use. You can't those. use that. You have to use renown. You can't. Whoa, did I get stronger? Wait, Bernadette's with him? Well, I didn't do that. That's what the game did. Oh, really? I didn't know they could do that. That's kind of cool. I think anyone can like line up with somebody else, but I I didn't know. I didn't know that. Either. That's really interesting. What about the sword of the creator? Is it? Oh, I traded it for another lance. <gasps> you can use the convoy. Oh, you put it in the convoy. Don't yeah, scare me because you, you need that weapon for the rest of the game. Yeah. Oh, I sold it for a penny. No, I'm just no. No, I just don't, put it in the convoy. Don't, I'm sorry. Don't scare me like that. I was like, what? I've just been what's using playing? like. What did you do now? I haven't really been using the sword of the creator leveling up, so Wait. I just. Is that a? Uh, is that who I think it is? Is that an enemy? I haven't seen an enemy on horseback yet. Cool. Bye. That one is expected. Yeah, that was fast. That was fun. It's all because. Oh, good. your horse riding Whoa. is now an A. Oh, impressive. Also See, I wish that your characters could also, um, like, your students could count toward recruiting other characters, but it's all Ambichon. Oh yeah. That's annoying. Well, I feel like Sylvain, in, in my mind, Sylvain and Demetra are both trying to win uh, Ingrid's heart. Felix is taken. He's got a net. What's done is done. That's right, Annette. Whoa, What's she, done can, is done. she can fly now? That's crazy. Uh, yeah, when she uses her sorcery, she sometimes seems to follow Oh, her. that's pretty cool. All right, so it looks like the yellow person we're going to have to take on. Uh, just so you know, like... Mm. When I've been trying to grind with um, Dorothea, sometimes Dorothea gets killed randomly and I have to start over. Whoops. She has very powerful magic, but she has terrible, like, what do you call it? Like, she defense. doesn't have very good defense. Mm. So I always have to kind of keep her behind Amy-chan or back. Okay. Like, I don't know. You can do whatever you want, but I've she's died six times. And nobody else has died in my entire party. She just keeps dying randomly. Well, I mean, she is a very low level. Oh. She can't gain any levels. If, if you... Let's see. Blaine is now level 28. Um, I think Dorothy is only... Let me see. It, it'll tell me if I click on her. Uh-oh. Yeah. Okay, I really hope she doesn't die at this point. She might... She just keeps she dying. Might, she, might, keep... she might. She might. She might. She might. She dead. Okay. She dead. All right. Should we start I over now? I can rewind time. Okay. Or... Okay. Nope, yeah. I can rewind. Let's rewind, and then we're gonna have to put her back, like... Yeah, I'm gonna have to leave her really far back. Um, there she was. There she was, that's fine. And then just... I would have her just move back with... She's a level 15. Yeah, let's move her back there. She's there a level 15. Everybody well, else is level 29, level really 27, weird. 30. Really weird that I just 30. About that. 29, 29, yeah, so 31, I, 30. Basically. Yeah, she is gonna get her butt kicked because this guy, what is what is he? He's a level 20. Yeah, so basically I only use Dorothea when Ready. enemies are really weak mm. and I just move her in for the kill at the end because she's just so weak right now. Well, at this point in the story, the characters can only uh, get to a certain level. Well, we're still gonna fortify everybody. In this area. I've never used Fortify before. Yeah. Oh, that's pretty cool. And there she goes back Good to being job, level 28. I am maturing at a rapid pace. And now it'll be the same thing, except for Dorothea won't get killed. Yeah, see, he's not gonna move. Oh, he is gonna move, but you can't get to where Dorothea is. These guys will survive. Yeah, because the bird can't fly. Dead! <sighs> oh. Wasn't enough to kill it yet. Well, that's surprising. Um, it did kill him, but he has two life bars. Uh, well, that's gonna. Uh, sorry, can, Mr. Bird. You can easily take him down. Oh, I can, but I want to collect some stuff. You can kind of pick stuff. and choose who you want to take. We him got off. we got some purple stuff here. Let me grab that. Put that to the convoy. Here goes. Yeah, you do that, Annette. Um, rally. Sorry, you like, man. Whatever. Whatever, I mean. Mrs. An I mean, Mr. Annette. <laughs> Mrs. <Wow>. Annette. <laughs> Felix. That's it. She's Mrs. Felix. Mrs. Felix. 
Oh, wait, no, I didn't want to do that yet. Oh, what? I, I missed, distracted uh, you. I missed one purple thing. That's fine. I completely distracted you. I'm so sorry. Time for exploring and Yay. supports. Lots of supports. I promise to be good this time. Huh. Ah, renown increased a little bit, but they don't tell you how much your renown increases. Okay. So we did the red mm -hmm. quest, and now it's time to instruct our class. Yay. Yeah, I'm actually kind of curious about this. All right. So, <laughs> last time I saw my students, they were not A's! Holy cow! Two A's! A! A! Not A's yet. Okay. Not A. Okay. A. Always A. Always A. Okay, I have a confession. I haven't been playing with Dimitri and Ingrid a lot. You don't need to! That You don't need to be level 30 at this point in the story! You don't need to be level 30 until at least chapter 12! But it helps me not to bite my nails as much when I'm watching... Hey, them. I love marching down field destroying enemies, so that's that's fine by me. Uh, but none of our students can be instructed. That's weird. Only Ash. Huh. Really? Yeah. That's weird. Alright, well, let's try to... Wait, why can't we instruct them? I don't know. All right. I thought he had like other weapons. Yeah. He he can use other weapons. I've learned a lot. Good. Do it again. Oh, that's a relief. Looking at. <laughs> You're making me blush. Aww. Uh oh. Don't Wait. What's the star for? I don't know. I've never seen. I've learned a lot. Wait, is he supposed to be a spear person? But I, I like know. it. I don't I don't have stars for this. I don't know what to say. What does that mean? Look, I don't know. I think that he's supposed to be a spearman. Really? Uh people in the chat, let us know, because no idea. Why is it we can't instruct the other people? Ah, uh, they're all mad at us. Why? There are no available units to auto instruct. Boo. Instruct, maybe do the first one. Right. Instruct, what's the first one? They won't let us. Alright, so these guys... You did auto-instruct, but there's a regular instruct at the top. Yeah, it says you have no people. Look, they're all... Oh, okay, all all right, great, I'm sorry. All grayed out. I understand. Now. Begin lecture! Great. Focus on faith skills. Excel as a bishop. Oh, she's gonna learn to maybe physic. Maybe. And it's... Oh. Mm. Oh. Oh, Professor. <laughs> I didn't realize you were there. If we keep running into each other like this, people will start to talk. Hey, don't get mad. I was joking. Ah, forget it. What do you need? Ooh. Another lover's quarrel. Uh -huh. <laughs> what do you want to say? Girl problems or... I don't know. I mean... Both I, are mean. I was... I I was gonna say girl problems, but... There you go. I fell for that girl recently, but I just wanted to have some fun and leave it at that. So, I told her we should break it off. I guess she was feeling a little more serious than I was. She started crying and everything got a bit complicated. Jerk. <laughs> That's fine. Come on, Professor. Playing around with girls is the most fun a guy can have. Besides, I don't care what you think of me. I don't intend to change how I live my life. I'm a good for nothing, if you haven't noticed. But I'm still a noble with a crest. That's all anyone cares about. Uh. It's best to avoid getting too serious with fools like that. It only leads to trouble. <laughs> I'm gonna be forced into an arranged marriage with some random noble woman anyway. By the way, Professor, you didn't know you had a crest, did you? I never thought much about it. Yep. I see. I suppose a mercenary wouldn't be concerned with such things. Most children who are born to noble families are tested upon birth to see if they bear one. Even descendants of the ten elites, like myself, can't be legitimate heirs without a crest. That means as children, we're only accepted if we're born with one. Ouch. The heads of most noble houses keep having kids until they get one with a crest. Those children then grow up to be heads of their houses, and the vicious cycle continues. Do you get it now? To all these commoner girls, 
I'm just a trophy. Or rather, a stud horse. Mm. Uh, they only want you for your bloodline? See? I knew you'd get it. These girls don't love me. They love the potential rewards of loving me. You just if want I me for my bloodline! If she gives birth to a child with a crest, that kid might become the next head of House Gautier. But nowadays, with the bloodlines getting weaker, there are a lot of kids like my brother, born with no hope. For ages now, those of us with crests have been envied and desired, but never for who we are. I understand the value of my blood. Believe me, I hate how much I understand it. I know better than to dream of being free from this burden. I'm used to it by now. I used to think I didn't have the right to live freely. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. You know what? I'm a bit jealous. The whole time you were growing up, you never knew you had a crest. You were free. Nobody pretended to like you. I kind of hate you for that. You were a spoiled brat who should pay for that crest. Maybe I'll collect the debt. What? <laughs> gotcha! Wow, you should have seen the look on your face just then. Don't mind me, Professor. After all, ladies love a dark and brooding noble. Hmm. Yeah, like Dimitri. <laughs> no. Oh my gosh. I don't understand. If he feels like girls just use him for his crest, why does he date at all? Guess we'll find out. Well, I had fun today. Of course, you want to see me again, yes? Uh, of course. I'd love to, Dorothea. <laughs> well, until we meet again. Wink. <laughs> oh, hello, Professor. Were you watching that? It's a different guy than I saw you with yes. yesterday. Is there a problem with She's that? perfect for Sylvain! Well, I, know I know what I'm doing. She is. My claim as a diva won't last forever, after all. I must look to the future. You might think about doing the same thing. Your beauty, and your gorgeous, won't last forever. Hmm. I feel like Zayn, but aging. Oh my gosh. I wish I could be that easygoing. Anyway, I'm not just playing games with these boys. This is for my future. You have no right to object. I very much want to find a good partner here at the Academy. Someone who will take care of me for the rest of my life. Mm. Finding someone to take care of me? <laughs> of course it is. Who could ask for anything more? Anyway, I value your opinion, Professor, but I won't have you interfering with my life plans. Ooh. Unless you'd like to take well, care of me into my hurts. old age. That'd be something, eh? How about it, Professor? Mm, I don't think so. I wasn't... <laughs> you aren't being serious, are you? I was just teasing. Or did you really just consider spending your whole life with me? <sighs> the thought I was just picturing her with that debilitating think of it, <laughs> disease. That thing. might sound pretty nice. <laughs> that you had to like spoon feed. But awfully quiet. You might even be blushing a bit. Have I embarrassed you? If so, I'm very, very sorry. I should be going anyway. <laughs> I'll see you later, <laughs> Professor. Watch your tone. With me. Nah, you didn't even get to say anything backhanded. Say wah, yes, wah. chef. Oh my gosh. <sighs> what now? Uh, Holy Kingdom of Fargus I'm, funding day is today. There's I'm a trying, special dish. Okay. I'm trying to be good. Oh, you mean Amy John didn't get to say anything yet? I didn't even get to pick these people. This is I know. My favorite. How did you know? Professor? It's like the game AI is this taking looks over. Delicious. Let's eat. The game wants to put those two together. They are so, like, tremendously age range difference. Who cares? They're cute. That's all I care about. But Mercedes is just gonna boss him around all over the place because she's way young, older than him. Actually, I have a... We did it! Never mind. <clears throat> oh, okay. These two are broken up now. No more perfects. Oh, I know who you're talking about. I, I, I You're I didn't. about your grandparents. Oh, my grandparents were opposites, yeah. No, well, they had an age range difference. They did? 
Yeah, so this your is grandma's how it's like done. way older than your grandma. Oh. And yeah, she was just small and cute. Now she what? She is small and cute. Oh! What's the tea party? Blue hair girl. Okay, let's go with uh, this tea. Uh, did you need something from me? Wow, she's so shy. Okay, offer some tea. Thank oh, she's like much. me when you met me. Yep. So nice and warm. I love how she's like looking down at the table and not looking at you at all. Okay, she likes books. Okay. Perfect recipes. I don't think she likes cooking. Plans for the future? Good. Well, that was a lucky guess. Mm. Okay, your ambitions. You seem well. Mm -hmm. I don't know. There we go. That was nice. She seems to like the tea, but it's a little hot. Delicious. It's a waste to spend your time with me. Ouch. What? Why are you putting yourself down? Um. Um, laugh at her. I don't know what admonish means! Dang it! Admonish. I think that means, like, you, like, give her a hard time or something. Thank you very don't much know. for the tea. Oh. I look forward to doing this again. One week from never. She looks very tired. Like... I think she's studying too hard uh, in school. Uh, oops. She, she, like, studies all night and has, like, one hour of sleep at night. Oh, my gosh. You now have allies who can take the master exam. I wonder why. <laughs> Thank I'm you, sorry. Amber. No, I mean, whatever. You received one master seal. Oh, all right. Well, let's um, look I around. I will not interfere. It's your playthrough. You will not interfere. Oh my gosh. I'll just make really weird <laughs> grimacing <laughs> facial expressions. Uh, I'm ready. Okay, so we've got. Um, Master Sam. Master. Wait, Dimitri's already a paladin. He doesn't have anybody who can be a. He doesn't have anything. Look at this. This is all zero. Who who can be a master? Obviously not Dimitri. Not right now. Um, Ambichon. No, wait. That's advanced. Darn it. I don't want to do that. Um, Ambichon. Mm. Ambichon. Ambichon's needed a class change for some time. No, she has nothing either. I don't know who can do the master exam. Maybe, um, uh, Shamir? Hmm. Well, why don't we, uh, take advantage of uh, an advanced thing? Oh, we still can't. Why can't we? Oh. Oh, we don't have any advanced seal. What does she need? She needs bow to be C or higher? Really? Wow. Okay. Mm -hmm. Huh. Well, at least our sword is at be, but we do... Who in the world can be a master, then? Ah, that's who. Ooh. Wow. She doesn't have a chance of passing yet, though. She needs reason to be... Reason and faith. What level does she need to be? An expert in all forms of magic. Well, she doesn't have anything else she can do right now. That's a bummer. Is that Queen or was she? Uh, I don't know. It's kind of cool looking. Or something. Nothing for him. Ash. You nothing for him. It. Oh. Nope. You gotta look again. There's no. Their little picture would be highlighted if if they can pass or if they can even take the exam. Well, that's a bummer. Well, Felix had one. He could go up. Mm hmm. He could go to advance. Okay. Why don't well, we do that? I don't that? know if we want to do it. It's a zero percent chance of. Uh, he could be a sword master. Uh, he doesn't look cool as a sword master. He could be an assassin. <laughs> he kind of looks like some kind of like person from Vegas. <laughs> I mean, it's fine. He looks like a Vegas person. Well, why don't we watch some more supports and then we'll think about it. I, I think I'll just close my eyes and you can pick something. I don't like. I don't know if I like a lot of the outfits. Wait. All right, just be careful what you do with Dimitri, because she has to Ingrid, end up. Do you have a moment? 
or I mean, we're going to perform an opera in the cathedral. Oh, uh, we are. Yes, it's a small one, but I need some volunteers. Let me tell you, Alois is very excited. He's already doing a ton of work for the show. I see. What's it about? Classic opera fair. A tragic love story, a princess who falls in love with a handsome commoner. But our princess, she carries the fate of her country on her shoulders. And no matter how in love she is, she can't just marry whoever she wants. Or can she? That's quite a story. Sounds tragic and beautiful. Who will be playing the princess? Me. I was a singer in an opera company, though I hope I'm not being too presumptuous casting myself. Even if you're not interested in being part of the production, you will come to see it, won't you? I'm asking everyone to dress up properly. I want it to be a stylish and elegant night. That does sound quite lovely. And I do want to go, but I, um... Please, don't worry if you can't make it. I understand we're doing this on such short notice. No, no, it's not that. I just... Uh, I struggle with the elegant part of things. It's not often that I do myself up in elegant clothing and makeup and such. If fashion's your concern, lady, you're in luck. I am? If you don't dress for the occasion, no one will take you seriously. But don't worry about a thing. I'll happily work my magic on you. When it's time, I'll meet you in your room. We'll make you the most beautiful woman in the theater. Oh, goodness. Okay. Oh, that's a fun well, friendship. I guess that was kind of nice. Yeah, that wasn't too bad. All right. Uh, Flane. Oh, with Dimitri. Interesting. Why not? More cooking. Yeah. Why are you out and about so late, Dimitri? Ah, uh, hello, Flane. I could ask you the same thing. Me? I was feeling restless and came here to think. I see. I'm here for the same reason. <laughs> How funny. But... are you feeling well? You look fairly pale. It's nothing. I just have a bit of a headache. Oh my. Headaches are quite troublesome, are they not? I am sure it will subside soon. Actually, I am quite talented when it comes to healing magic. If you will allow me, I will have you feeling better in no time. That's kind of you, but I'm fine. But... why not? Have I offended you somehow? This headache is something I've dealt with for a while now. Ever since my family and friends were murdered before my eyes, I must never forget that day. I must never allow their deaths to be forgotten. Mm, wow. I feel this headache is a reminder of sorts. Of those I failed to protect. And of their murderers who still roam free. I see. That would explain your somber demeanor. Still, I do not agree with all you are saying. I feel that if I were your father or any of your dear friends whom you lost, I would want you to let go of me eventually. I would never want someone whom I care deeply for to be pained by the loss of me for eternity. And I doubt they would want that either. Perhaps. Unfortunately, they have left this world, so I can no longer ask their preference. Aww. We cannot ask them directly, but we can imagine how they might have felt. You know who they were as people. As for me, if I am ever to be but a memory in your future, I want you to remember me in a way that brings you joy. I would want you to smile when you recalled me, to feel warmed by the notion that I cherished your company. I cannot imagine I am the only one who feels this way. Surely anyone who loved another would wish only for their peace and happiness. Why am I, I shipping them now? I must apologize. I was out of line, clearly. I must get some rest now. Please do not stay up too late yourself. Good night, Flane. And... Thank you. Holy cow! Mm. What just happened? I feel like Dimitri might need a little Flane in his life. Oh my gosh! He needs somebody to cheer him up. What just happened? I don't know. Everything was set in stone! Stop it, game! Everything is different now. Uh...
Oh. Felix, my goodness, I swear you're always training. Such a hard worker. So strong. Hello? Felix? What? <laughs> you can hear me. That's good. I was worried maybe your ears didn't work. What do you want? Oh, nothing. Nothing in particular, I mean. But now that I'm here, and now that you've asked, when you've finished up, do you think you'd like to join me in the dining hall for something sweet? I'll pass. I don't like sweets. Also, you're a nuisance. Stay away from me. Wow, Felix. That's not a very nice way to talk to a classmate. That's because he's anyway, already living you it. you sound like you're shooing away a stray cat. I like how he treats other girls. Shut up. It's good. He only I has one. I am not a stray cat, Felix. And I am not leaving until you take a moment to chat with me. Ah, <sighs> you are a pest. Fine, do what you will. Oh, you better believe I am going to keep doing exactly what I will. He's like, good for you. Maybe instead of a sweet treat, we can get something spicy. Would you like that? I've heard the dining hall is serving a dish with some western spices in it. Mmm. Does that sound good, Felix? Would you like something spicy instead of sweet? You're distracting me. When I am hungry, I will eat. Alone. Stop squawking at me. <laughs> well, since you asked so nicely, I'll leave you in peace. Goodbye, Felix. Finally. I kind of like Felix now. Mm. That girl is like completely just like hitting on him and he's just like, nope. Nope. Okay. Sylvain, it's unusual to find you doing something other than hitting on women. Ah, Dorothea. I've been preparing to do just that, as it were. My intention is to flirt with the monastery's most beautiful flower, Dorothea herself. Oh dear. And I've ruined all your hard work. You might as well save the effort. I'm not taking the bait. <laughs> oh, Dorothea, your wit is as sharp as your beauty. Don't you want just a little flirting? Just a sample. I'm not like all the others, you know. I don't doubt it. By not like all the others, do you mean how serious you are about being disingenuous when you flirt? And that is supposed to mean what exactly? Your social standing isn't bad, and you're not bad to look at or particularly dumb. You could easily be engaged by now. But you just flit from one woman to the next without settling on anyone. I bet you enjoy going out with them, but you hate women themselves, don't you think? Me? Hate women? <laughs> that couldn't be further from the truth. I'm always serious when it comes to matters of the heart. When I flirt, I stake my life on it. Uh-huh. I'll believe it when I see it. Staking your life on a person is the sort of thing you should only do when you're in love. Mm. That's what I've been saying. I love you enough to stake my life on it. Wow. And I'm seriously in love with each and every girl I flirt with. I see. Regardless, I'm not staking my life on you. So you'd better go and fall in love with someone else. Goodbye, Sylvain. <sighs> She's stone cold. I love it. All right, and now I like Dorothea. Wow. <laughs> like, let's see. First, Felix put Dorothea in her place. Now Dorothea mm -hmm. put Sylvain in his place. Mm -hmm. Like interesting. I think Dorothea could keep Sylvain in line. Maybe. I think so, Luke. Yeah, I think I picked a good, a good thing. All right, so now let's. It's all coming in order to plan. Mm -hmm. Everything interesting. is. All right, so. Yeah. Apparently, Master Seal is ah, one hundred and eighty-nine thousand. Um, Luke, you haven't even sold all your bullions, but it's fine. I kind of want to now. Uh, <laughs> I gotta see. Wait, this is a convoy. You have to go all the way down to the bottom of it. I did go all the way down to the con. <laughs> this is okay. It. Where where are you? Are you in the item I shop? Was, I was. In, you yeah. have to go to sell. Oh. 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 
to go all the way to the... Whoa! There you go. <laughs> um... We'll sell that! Maybe we should just wait and not sell them all at the same time. Nope, we're gonna sell them all! Luke! I wanna see this Are you sure about this? 5,000? Well, we might accidentally spend it all in one place. Cool! No! I've never had this much money to mess around I with. I worked so hard! No, it's all gonna go... Oh, I thought it was oh, gonna go much higher than that. Oh, I that was gonna that. be way more. Alright, I wanna buy... Can we buy Master Seal? Do they, do they sell those yet? I don't think we can. Alright, just uh, advanced seal, intermediate. No. You can buy one intermediate seal if you want to make yourself happy. No, I'm good. So, the the master seal probably won't pop up for another chapter yet because you got them so early. <laughs> uh, well, actually, we have one, but we don't meet the requirements for it yet. So that's... Well, while I'm here, let's um, replenish our battalions. If you want to switch, um, have her trade with the convoy and make sure she gets her sword of the creator, you can do that. Yeah, I'll, I'll, uh, I'll have. You her... can do that before the battle. Okay. For you. Yeah. All right. Um. Well, that is pretty much it. I thought today. we would have more conversations than that. I did too, but I, I guess because so many people are close to A rank, uh, they can't do it yet. So. It's really yeah. interesting. But anyway, people, that is going to do it for today's episode. Join us next time as I believe yeah. we're doing something Paralog related. Uh, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, all that fun stuff. And we will see you with more Fire Emblem Three Houses tomorrow on Cameron's Let's Plays. God bless and happy gaming. See ya.